My name is Daryl Jenkins, and I'm the membership director for St. Joseph's Knights of Columbus Council 10287. On behalf of the brothers and the Knights of Columbus, I'd like to let you know and let your families know that you're in our prayers and thoughts as we navigate this coronavirus pandemic together. Many of you in the parish are aware of the charitable works of the Knights of Columbus, and many are not. For years, I was part of the many. Attending St. Joseph's for almost 20 years before I ran into Terry Gibbons, who was a member of the Knights and spoke so passionately about the works that they were doing that it intrigued me to go home and do some research for myself. As I was preparing to take the next step in my faith journey, I saw that the Knights of Columbus was a perfect fit. And I became a member in the year 2018. And it has been a best decision that I've made. Now that I've shared a little bit about my faith journey into the Knights of Columbus, I wanted to share with you who we are and what we do. The Knights was founded by Father Michael J. McGivney in 1882 in New Haven, Connecticut, with a mission of service, charity, and faith formation. Today, the Knights of Columbus consist of approximately two million men nationwide that continue the efforts and vision of Father Michael J. McGivney. The Knights of Columbus is founded on the principles of charity, unity, fraternity, and patriotism. And it is these principles that serve as our core foundation of our fundamental values of integrity, respect, professionalism, and excellence. Now that I've shared a little history of who we are, now I'd like to share with you what we do. Simply stated, we are an organization of men making a difference in our world and in our local communities by putting our faith into action. Our current mission state in the Knights of Columbus is, we are Catholic men building a bridge back to faith. There is good and necessary work that needs to be done in this world and Knights do it every day. We achieved this mission statement through our Faith in Action program. Our Faith in Action program consists of four programs revolving around faith, family, community, and life. And each one of these programs have sub-programs within them with goals to assure that we meet the goals and strive to meet our mission within each one of these categories. Now I'd like to outline for you some of the fraternal benefits that you get as a member of the Knights of Columbus. First, you get the opportunity to support our local parish, as well as be involved in numerous amounts of activities in the local community. Also, you get the fellowship and support of your local brothers. Last and not least, you get access to top rate insurance and investment opportunities. These are just a short list of the benefits that you get as a member of the Knights of Columbus. I've shared with you a high level view of what the Knights of Columbus program is all about. In the upcoming weeks, we'll be sending out email information in detail to further answer any questions that you may have. In closing, I would like to invite you to become a member of our St. Joseph's Council Knights of Columbus 10287. I know we all lead very busy lives and you look at yourself and say, how can I add one more thing to the plate? But with the Knights, it's not about how much you can give, it's about give what you can. If you are interested in becoming a Knight, please see the information up on the screen. You can reach us at stjosephsplacentia.org under ministries and fill out the information form or you can reach out to me personally on my email address at Daryl underscore Jenkins at sbcglobal.net or reach out to me on my cell phone at 714-865-9414. Once again, thanks for your time and attention today. Stay safe and healthy and may God continue to bless you. Have a great day.